Welcome to Elementary Summer Reading All Together Now for the week of August 2nd, 2023, Part 1. Friends Stick Together by Hannah E. Harrison. I'm Rupert. I like reading dictionaries, listening to classical overtures, and eating cucumber sandwiches with no crust. This is Levi. He's a tick bird. He likes corny jokes. Why do bees always have sticky hair? Because they use honeycombs. Ha 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 ha. Armpit farts. <laughs> and popping wheelies. He just showed up one day. Hi, I'm Levi. I like the jeans. And sat on my nose. I think you and me are going to get on like biscuits and gravy. And now I'm stuck with him. The other birds are cool. Harold recites Shakespeare. To be or not to be, that is the question. Judith can sing opera. Figaro, Figaro, Figaro! But Levi, Levi burps the alphabet. Burp, Q, burp, R. Burp S, burp T, burp U, burp V, burp W, burp X, burp Y. Making friends was hard before, but now it's pretty much impossible. <laughs> In music class, Levi likes to play epic guitar solos at inappropriate times. Chica, chica, chica. Toot, toot, toot. Ching, ching, ching. Plink, plink, plink. Be dow, do, be dow, do, be, be, boo, bow, ba, bow, bow. During lunch, he makes a big to do about eating my ticks and grosses everyone out. Yummy, tastes like chicken. Just kidding, tastes like tick. And in gym class, he draws even more attention to my shameful lack of upper body strength. No worries, Rupee. I'll be the brawn. You be the brains. If you're happy and you know it, stretch your toes. If you're happy and you know it, stretch your toes. Levi has got to go. So in music class, I play the wrong notes loudly in Levi's direction. But he doesn't miss a beat. Chick, 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 chick. Plinkety plink, plinkety plink, plink. Be dow dow, be dow dow, be be bow, 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 bow. Ting, itty, ting, ting, itty, ting. Chinga, chinga. During dodgeball, I twist and turn so that Levi gets nailed by the ball every single time. But, woo-wee, this is not our sport. He always bounces back. And at recess, I try flinging him off me with centrifugal force. I get sick in the trash can, but Levi has the ride of his life. That was awesome! I decide it's time to be direct, so I say, Levi, I find your boisterousness a tad loathsome. Huh? Your uncouthness is slightly problematic. My what? I want to be alone. Oh, he says and hops down. Sorry, Rupert. I just thought you looked like you could use a friend. Then he shuffles off to go hide in a bush. The next day at school, Levi is nowhere to be found. Music class is nice and harmonious, but also a little boring. Ting, plink, chick, toot, figaro, figaro, figaro. At lunch, I have my favorite cucumber sandwiches, but I can't even enjoy them because I'm so itchy. And in gym, instead of me and Levi getting picked last for teams, it's just me. 
friend, noun, a person who is attached to another by feelings of affection, a person who gives assistance, a patron, supporter, a person who is on good terms with another, not hostile. I think Levi might have been right. And I feel terrible. So after school, I go to Levi's house and knock on his door. Knock, knock. Who's there? Rhino. Rhino who? Rhino, I was wrong and you were right. And I'm really sorry. Can we be friends? Levi laughs and opens the door. He says, I don't know. You can be a little highfalutin. Huh? It's an adjective. Means too big for your britches. My what? Yeah, he says, we can be friends. I'm Rupert. Turns out I like classical air guitar, corny jokes, and my good friend Levi. Pling a pling a pling pling. Be doo doo, be doo doo, be be. Wanda, what in the world are they doing? Earl, I have no idea. The end. We're going to make an Asian spin drum, and these are actually kits I got from Oriental Trading. Um, the instructions that came with the kits are in your bags, um, but I also wrote out instructions on your um, inserts. Um, your parts are the drum part. You have some stickers. Um, they did say Happy New Year, but since it's not the New Year, I got rid of those ones. Um, two beads. And a stick. So all you got to do is find the little hole in the bottom, which might be covered up. Mine was covered up. You had to feel for it. But you can see there. You want to stick your stick in there. Guess you could stick a little glue on there if you wanted to. The next thing you're gonna do is stick your stickers on. They're big foam stickers. So I'm gonna put that one there. Flip it over. Put the other one on. same way. Should have paid attention. Okay, so those are on. Then you're going to put the beads on the ends and you have to tie a knot in the end so they don't go flying off. Um, you don't want the knot too high or else the beads won't be low enough to hit the drum. So that one seems to be on. I'm going to put the other one on. And again, you put a knot in the end. He doesn't come off and then that's it and you twist it back and forth and it makes a drum sound I guess maybe we'll put a little bit of glue and let it sit for a while but that's it all there is to it let's see if what happens after I put glue okay on. I'm putting glue on the inside of the hole around the edges could be a lot and I'm putting glue on the end of the stick that goes up into the drum and then I'm just going to jam that back up in there and leave it sit until it dries and then hopefully that'll work better okay there with the glue on it it does work a lot better it doesn't spin so 
I suggest using glue. Can you see that? Well, it's easier if you use two hands, but I have to hold the iPad with the one, but that's how it works.